This 47th meeting of ICANN is a great honor for us as Zedna to host. You are also in the province of KwaZulu-Natal, one of our nine provinces that make up South Africa. KZN, as it's fondly called, is also the home province of our president. It is not too far from here, in a small town called Hawik, in this province, KwaZulu-Natal, that on the 5th of August, 1962, Nelson Mandela was arrested on his return from the Pan-African Freedom Movement for Central, East, and Southern Africa in Addis Ababa. Thus began the incarceration of the father of our nation, a global icon, and his long road to freedom. 21 months after Nelson Mandela's release from Victor Fiste Prison, at Rhodes University in Grahamstown on the 12th of November 1991, the first internet protocol packets started flowing out of South Africa on a lease circuit to Portland, Oregon, USA. In that context, and within the South African history context, just after that mail, a month after that flow of that mail, Nelson Mandela led a team at the Convention for a Democratic South Africa, or CODESA as we fondly call it, to commence the negotiations that led to the establishment of a democratic, constitution-based free South Africa. Zedna's own long road to freedom commenced with its establishment in 2003. In 2003, the internet industry, the skill set, and the intellectual capacity on domain name systems still reflected our hideous past. The only delegates of color that participated in ICANN meetings were those sitting in GAC sessions. To date, were it not for the establishment of Zedna, the South African delegate participation in ICANN meetings would continue to be anemic of diversity and which should reflect our rainbow nation. Similar to Codesa, Convention for a Democratic South Africa, we as Zedna had an obligation to launch our own long road to freedom through CODI, and that's a Gadger acronym, Convention for a Democratic Internet. Through a public and industry participation process, we quickly established that a central registry-based business model would propel us into a global best practices model Initially, we communicated that a request for proposal be issued to operate a central registry. This prompted interest, considerable interest from glo global registry operators and local players began to position themselves. It became clear to us that embarking on a commercial-based model would not address the lack of diversity amongst our people as internet and DNS practitioners. Similar to opposing parties meeting at CODESA, we too became acutely aware that we needed to harness the skills, expertise, and experience of the pioneers of the internet in South Africa. People such as Mike Lowry, who on that 12th of November 91, managed that first internet protocol packet flow out of South Africa to Oregon. We need to harness the assets and expertise of the largest registry in South Africa maybe even in africa.co.za. Our CODI, or Convention for a Democratic Internet, took five years to deliver a product. As CODESA culminated in a free democratic South Africa, our own convention resulted in the establishment of the ZACR, the South African Central Registry. We as South Africans, in our own way, proved to ourselves that legacy-induced differences and separateness can be bridged as we as South Africans can perform our own miracles. The democratization in a South African context of the registry operations has created many new opportunities. Working with others on the continent of Africa, Zedna as the policy and regulatory body, and ZACR as the registry operator can participate meaningfully in the growth and development of the internet. 
This unleashing of these opportunities is aptly demonstrated by the collaborative role played between the ZACR team and other role players on our continent, including the AU, in ensuring that the new GTLD, Dot Africa, is owned, managed, developed for the benefit of Africa. An African solution for Africans by Africans. We are very proud of this and congratulate the entire team of Africans in passing the initial evaluation for Africa. Our collective efforts on the continent will increase the diversity of participants in ICANN meetings, not just in GAC sessions, but in the different components that make up the ICANN community. We want to thank many of you in the ICANN community in assisting and supporting us in modernizing our governance, regulation, and operation of the name and numbering system in South Africa. I especially want to thank Chris Despain from AUDA, Leslie Cowley from Nominet, Keith Davidson and Jay Daly from New Zealand, Adrian Kinderes and his team from OS Registry, and George Sadowski. <laughs> of course, my thanks go to the ZNA board, the ZACR board and management team, our government, and many other stakeholders. We wish you a memorable conference, and may you have a wonderful time in our country. Finally, all of us are aware of Nelson Mandela's long road to freedom in a different context, continues. All South Africans have been united in their prayers and vigils for Nelson Mandela during his current stay in hospital in Pretoria. He has given and sacrificed his life for a free and democratic South Africa. It is poignant that ICANN 47 conference takes place in South Africa during the week South Africa will be celebrating Madiba's birthday on the 18th of July. This probably gives us in the internet industry an opportunity to take some 67 minutes of our busy schedules this Thursday, 18th of June, July, to honor Madiba's legacy. ZEDNA and ZACR, in partnership with ICANN and the AF Star organization, invite ICANN delegates to join them this Thursday morning and travel to a local high school in Chesterville to give 67 minutes of our time in honor of Madiba. We are planning to get our hands dirty for 67 minutes, painting and reviving that high school's infrastructure. We hope the 67 minutes you spend on Nelson Mandela Day during ICANN 47 meeting will leave an indelible mark in your memory of your visit to South Africa. Details of the store will be published on the ICANN Durban COSA website. Welcome, welcome to Durban, welcome to South Africa. Thank you.